Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and a little bit of a talk over about my newest save file called Silent Shores. It's gonna be just like my other two save files. It's gonna be overhaul with combined lots of me renovations and me done builds and Maxis made builds and Maxis builds renovated by me. Uh, here's uh, Willow Creek right now. I have moved over all the commercial lots up here where we have a gym, we have a library, restaurant and a bar. And this is going to be a bowling bar because people here love bowling. And we also have a Willow Creek park. And down here I have done... Uh, every address is new as well. These are not... Um, Anything, you know, weird, whatever, they are pretty simple as they are. And there's going to be new families, there's going to be uh, families that have aged up, there's going to be families who you will not find anymore, and there will be people who have changed lifestyle statuses, relationship statuses, and whatever not. And in Oasis Springs, we have museum and a Roman court over here, who is that, that is a restaurant. Then we also have a, a pool over here. This was made by Maxis and I'm in work in process of renovating it. It's a big lot with a lot of weird stuff going on. A lot of updates have happened ever since they have created some uh, builds. So let's just, you know, ignore some of the oddities. I haven't changed everything because they are just quality of life changes after all. Uh, then there, ha then we have a couple of these like container homes over here with one lot empty. We have, of course, a Mirage Canyon Cafe that is also uh, familiar from a Friends TV show. We have a couple of uh, houses over here. You can get you you know like a two single people or a couple and a single or whatever living under the same lot with with the two separate builds you can lock doors for those who don't want them to enter the house or whatever then we have a gym over here it has um this for example it is a lot that i have used on my other saves as well i am gonna change it up slightly up more but i haven't gotten around to it quite yet we have a little bit of a lag here but it's okay so this is a build that has a lot of like other things and stuff as well so we are gonna have uh, apartments here that i have emptied up we have like a cafeteria over here we have music uh, store and a laundromat in the same but obviously they're not gonna be functional as far as I know as soon as I hit gym for this there's not gonna be a, a, a barista over here but anyway there's a couple of uh, basketball hoops over here and then we have uh, the showers and whatnot and then all the gym equipment that is required over here then we also have a nightclub I don't remember if this was built by me or Maxis and then of course we have um, the copper route over here and then we have the little cheaper homes down this way i have tried to um, have some cheaper some more expensive you know for all all ranges of life basically here then we have newcrest and you will find some lots empty all right i haven't left many empty but some and for example, over here, I have very old build of mine over here that I have tried to give some uh, renovation to. I don't change the full build. I go and change some colors, maybe remove some items or change items, but that's it. Like I'm not gonna go into a full blown big renovations on them. Over here, we have like a 50s, 50s uh, builds over here. We have a couple houses on this lot. It's really nice to share with a, like a family couple or whatever. Then we have a little bit of a modern route uh, over here, like a little boulevard of modern houses. So that's nice. Then I also made Magnolia and all these builds are actually from Maxis and I just decided what they are. There's two retail lots and then, then there is our art center and a thrift and bubble tea shop store over here. Uh, they, they are 
functional as far as I have been able to test right now. Then we have Winterberg that I have started slowly to think of what we could do with, but I haven't gotten too far with it actually. I have been planning on paper and whatever, what to do. And then we have uh, families that have gotten um, makeovers. We have C few here and you actually saw uh, baby Ariel and Benali already gotten their makeovers. And then we have the apartment renovations. Of course, I try to renovate them in a different styles and way and change items and colors to what I have not used before. But they are all something that I will try to, you know, get functional and budget wise comfortable because yeah, it's a city. I'm a little confused about Forgotten Hollow. I don't really care for the vampires. I don't know if I will just ignore this place altogether and just, um, you know, leave it as is because I don't, I don't tend to play with vampires at all. Um, there, in my not so berry, there's one vampire that has been in the let Let's Play since I started in like 2017 or something. It has been always there, but um, I have not, you know, really played with them at all. I like some of the items from the back, but that's it. So no, no idea what to do with that yet. Any ideas? Give them to me. Obviously Copperdale, I have um, gone and done auditorium and school uh, changes because I wanted to give new ones of those. And um, I guess that's pretty much the biggest things. I did something in Tartosa, I'm pretty sure. No, no, I didn't yet. Actually, never mind. I'm gonna change some some stuff here as well. So um, I have some ideas for this as well. But I still don't own uh, werewolves. So you're, <laughs> you don't see the map here actually, but I, I don't own it. So if you own uh, werewolves and you want to use the save file, it's uh, fine. The werewolf uh, map will be untouched. So that won't uh, affect anything. And if you don't own some of the packs or kits or expansions, whatever, something that I have, it's fine. The game will be either deleting the item or replacing it with a uh, base game item. Um, I tried with some CC items, like if I forget, um, like uh, use a build that I have used CC on and I place it in the game that doesn't have any CC on, it replaces it with, uh, some random base game item. And if, if it looks off, it's because it is off. It's not meant to be like that, but uh, it, it's what it is. I'm a human, I miss things, and I don't always, you know, catch on everything that's probably gonna, you know, slip through the fingers and whatever not. But yeah, this is what I'm working on again. Do you actually use any save files? Do you like to start any like uh, different type of save files for you now because the base game is the first save file is always the same people are in the same stage and start as young and whatever not do you like to see people in different you know in different clothes and different ages and moved on and left the careers or changed careers or whatever do you like that let me know happy simming i'll see you in the next video Bye bye